what's going on? Today I'm gonna to tackle a level 10 cast puzzle. This is known as the Infinity Puzzle by Hanayama. Hanayama known for their difficult cast puzzles. This one is no exception. It is one of the hardest in the collection. The whole point of this is to take out the two bearings that are between this infinity symbol and then to put it back in again. Sounds easy, uh, but knowing Hanayama probably isn't. I think the last Hanayama puzzles that I attempted were the chess piece puzzles. If you've not seen that video, go ahead and check that out. But they were not a level 10. These are, this is gonna be quite difficult. I'm looking forward to it sort of these things take time, sometimes hours, and I'm hoping that's not the case, but whatever it may be, uh, we're gonna we're gonna do it. We'll do it. Also guys, before we get into today's video, I got some really, really exciting news that I've been waiting a long time, and I know some of you guys have been waiting on this too. The merch store is now live. Check out ramfamshop.com to cop your new RamFam merch. Check this out. If you wanna support this channel, you wanna be part of the RamFam, go ahead and cop yourself this shirt. We got uh, pink, there's uh, black, there's gray, we got crewnecks, there's all sorts of different stuff that you guys can check out. I'll leave the link below, it's the first link in the description, ramfamshop.com. Also to be noted, these are designed and printed in Montreal and will be shipping out of Montreal, Canada. So, in case you were wondering. Enough of that, let's tackle today's puzzle. Well, already then, this is uh, supposedly a level 10 cast puzzle by Hanayama. So first thing I notice is that they push up and out and in. They also rotate from time to time. Oop. So I'm guessing if I rotate, they fall through. Just gotta push it up and down and keep rotating it, I think. Let's see, this one's already almost out. Okay. I think I've almost solved this puzzle already. Look how far that one is. This one, this one doesn't seem to rotate at all. This side here. It's definitely a pattern here somewhere. As I try to shim one, the other gets stuck. So they have these little cogs here. I'll show you in a sec once I rotate one. So there's these little cogs that kind of stop right here. They kind of stop everything from rotating. And that's also what's holding, I think, the other one in place. I'm gonna try to go clockwise first. Clockwise is this one. Would be counterclockwise. There we go. They keep dropping down levels, I guess. Seems like this one's like out. What do I need to do here? The other one spins too. Uh oh. Hmm. Hmm. Just trying, I'm getting confused with the orientation. Like clockwise here is obviously not clockwise here. It's counter clock or clockwise here would be counterclockwise on the other side. Okay, clockwise here. Clockwise where the infinity is. That's what we're looking for. Or this one turns, or I don't know. Clockwise. It seems to want to go counterclockwise, so you know what? Proving to be quite difficult. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie here. Orientation is everything. So if I want to turn it this way, oh, so close. You gotta like lift and turn sometimes. So that's tricky to find that exact spot, and then it won't turn there. So I'm guessing I have to do it on this side. But if I do it on this side, I, I can't turn the same way. I have to turn the other way, or. Take the bottom one. That felt good. Seems to be stuck now. I'm almost out. I feel I'm almost out. I keep turning it the, the correct way, I think. Um, again, it gets a bit tricky. I've been constantly rotating it this way. Counterclockwise is if I go clockwise, I think I'm going backwards, but it seems to be the only move that I can do. He's 
little notches on the inside. That's what's stopping everything. What kind of puzzle is this? Because this one barely turns. This one turns more. I don't know why. I don't know if that's a thing. Maybe my thing is defunct. I feel like I'm at square one right now. I feel like I'm going backwards right now. pattern here somewhere. I just can't see it. I can't see the pattern. I think I figured this out. So here's what I'm thinking after all this time. There are many, 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 many steps. This thing unscrews about three or four times, and then this thing moves once. I'm gonna take this back all the way to the beginning so I can move this once again. And I think that's the solution here. And if I do that over and over and over, I will finally be able to open it. Now, you see my notch that's here? It started here, it went there, now it's there. Now I think, boom, now it's here. Now watch what happens. This is, this is really cool. Now, I can turn this one all the way. Oh, hold on. No, that worked though. So hold on. Boom. Turn it once. Turn it twice. Three times. Turn it four times. There you go. Five times. And now we're stuck. So what are we going to do? We're going to move that down one again. Now we got to get this one back to the beginning. So we got to twist it. I think I'm really figuring this out. This is kind of awesome. Um, I gotta twist, there we go, one. And you gotta kinda shimmy it, two, three, no, two. It's gonna go all the way back to the beginning, I think, here. There we go, boom, 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 back to the beginning. Now watch this, bam. Oh, oh, what? What? That's incredible. I did it. Can this one come out though? There we go, bam. I figured, I actually figured it out. I did not, it wasn't luck. I mean, luck was for the first half hour. It was just messing around until I started understanding that those notches had something to do with it. These notches are actually the indicators. You need to know where you are in the puzzle and that Freaking awesome. <laughs> All right, can we put this back together? I don't know which one goes where. Uh-oh, uh -oh, trouble. I'll just take a guess. I'll guess this one goes here. Well, stay tuned for the next video where we're gonna put this puzzle back together. No, I'm just kidding. I think I'm fine. There we go. <sighs> Thank you. All right, guys, that was it for the level 10 Hanayama cast infinity puzzle. Pretty difficult, uh, kind of frustrating. I was. Not gonna lie, I was very frustrated. Uh, at one point, I felt like I was moving forwards and then backwards, and I had no, it almost seemed like there was no point of reference for like the longest while. And I think that's what makes this a difficult puzzle is that you have to find the point of reference. It isn't obvious at all, but it's kind of like a clock that you have to tick around. And once I figure that out, it's like something just clicked. And I think that's the beauty of puzzle and then puzzle solving is once you figure it out something just clicks within your mind and when that happens there's such a rush of oh my god this is genius and so I was waiting for that click in my mind to happen and hoping it would hoping I didn't have to film for eight hours uh, it probably took me like an hour and a half um, and then once it clicked it was like easy peasy so really really fun puzzle definitely something you could try out I'll leave the link below where you guys can check them out they're not too expensive you can you know uh, watch your friends struggle with them for a couple days it'd be pretty funny but anyways guys that is it for me for today thank you so much for watching I know I haven't posted in a while I got a couple videos coming up as well this weekend so be stay be be stay for that all right whatever like this video subscribe if you're new here uh, hit the notifications and we'll see you on the next video peace rap. Right.